Hey there, Jay here, and I just watched the fourth episode of Andor, and I can give my thoughts brief here because a lot of my praises continues from my last review of the last three episodes. So yeah, aside from what they did in the last three episodes, they were good and they managed to continue here. This episode really dives into the expanding of the galaxy. Spoiler alert again. We get to see Coruscant, we get to see all these words, we get to see all these elements of change. We get to see how the Empire works. We get to see the ISB for the first time in live action, I think. And it's not just surface exploration, there is also deep exploration. We get quite political with the ISB, we get quite real with the whole rebel things going on. And every character has a deeper layer there, like. Of course, on surface, some characters are there just to be there, but behind their intention, there's so much there that is telling. Which is another thing quite different from the previous series, like the Mandalorian, we have this week to week quest, and there are characters that appear there, but they are just there. Here, we get introduced to a character, but without telling us their history, they let us know that this character has some history. There is something behind that and it makes them feel more tangible, I would say. And it makes me more invested and this is probably the most invested I have been into a Star Wars series this year. So yeah, that's a good thing and again, I hope all of the pros here continue on as the series continues. But anyway, what do you think about Endor so far? Feel free to let me know your thoughts down in the conversation below.